Kobe, you here? Yeah, they don't see, they don't see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, don't let them. Nah, this lobby's good, bro. Charlie. I'm not fucking this shit up. I'm capping C right now. I like how they all just ran away from it, too. Mm hmm. Thanks, teammates. I'm not even. Hold up. Hold up. Hey, there we go. That was super nice, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, that would have been disgusting if I had hit that, god damn it. Yeah, you never know. Oh yeah, this is it. So that was the first four. Oh, it showed it back to back. Look at that. Using the regular fire with the sniper, and it's good. I have no idea if it does. I'm just using it. Drax, what's up? Oh, that was a cold feel. All right, what's good, boys? So I'm already level 31. As you can see, I have tried out the Tundra. I have it right now. Obviously, I do not have all the attachments for it. I'm still unlocking it. But I can tell you already that without even having ADS attachments right now, this Tundra already 100 times better than the Pellington. And this thing consistently one shots, which is the thing that I was most worried about. Because if you played the first beta, you know how bad the Pellington was when it comes to consistent one shots. It's just you get a lot of really, really unnecessary hit markers. And I don't even have the ADS attachments. So it's a little slow right now, but this is way, way better than the ton than the uh, Palantins. So this is something that I am definitely gonna be maining this year. So I'm gonna keep playing. I'm obviously going to level up this gun as much as I can, get all the attachments for it, and then we can hopefully do some serious, serious damage with this thing. This, this is a game changer right here. This feels more like the alpha than it did the first beta, and I'm loving this. So I cannot wait for this. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you guys enjoy this video, please leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. Also, please subscribe if you are new. We are 400 subs right now from 639,000. I'm going to go get these attachments right now. We're going to have a lot of fun with this gun. One playing in PC. No, I'm playing on PC. Oh, nah. Oh my god, it's so much better. It is so much better than the Pellington. Hi, Foster. Hi, Sniper. Oh. 44 kills with this gun with no attachments. I'm telling you, this this is gonna be so good when we have them. Oh, and you gotta play the game. Yeah. Look at this. Not a hit marker in sight. I need a this is great. 't even care if that wasn't a quad feed that was nasty Don't get cocky. We need to repeat that level. that guy got slapped oh Oh, I hit a Clyde headshot and didn't even know that. Oh, God, dude. That was nice. Yeah, 
Yo, even for a three piece, that was nasty. Oh my god. All right, boys, what's good? So after maxing out the Tundra, I figured that there's probably gonna be a lot of comments on the video asking my class setup. So I thought I would show you guys really quick. This is probably the best class setup as far as ADS goes, because I know although the Tundra is super hard hitting and it is a really, really fun to use, it is obviously a little bit slower ADS than the Pelinton. So I thought for the best class setup, this is the class setup that I use. And honestly, I feel like this is probably one of, if not the best class setups for the Tundra on this game so far. Obviously, I run the normal sniper scope, so I don't run an optic. For the muzzle, I would run stabilizer because there is a lot of sway. For the barrel, I would run the 26.5 inch Overlord barrel. And the reason why is because the fire rate, the fire rate is going to be super important. I don't run a laser to be honest, even with laser, even with any of the lasers I noticed, I really am not hitting any no scopes. So I just don't see a point in running the laser. Plus none of the laser attachments actually help with ADS too. For under barrel, you don't have to use one of these either. You honestly could probably use a stock. I'm not using a stock right now. I'm just using the front grip under barrel simply because of the centering and reduced recoil a little bit. I feel like because the Tundra just kicks so hard, I feel like you probably should run this, but once again, you could use a stock if you don't want to use this. For the magazine, I've just been running the seven round because anything else, really, I don't see a point in it. You do need seven shots rather than five. Uh, you could run the fast mag, but I feel like for streaks, at least, it's probably better if, if you have at least seven. You can't use this because it reduces your aiming speed. You can't use this because it reduces your aiming speed. And you can't use this because it also reduces your aiming speed. And that's obviously going to be super, super important with ADS. For the handle, this is another really important attachment. You want to run the Task Force Rear Grip. I forgot what level you unlock it at. I think it's weapon level 34, something like that. This is really one of the most important attachments on this Tundra, though. If you guys would like to see another Cold War beta video before the beta is officially done, just let me know. Otherwise, I will go back to uploading Modern Warfare. I know beta videos get kind of repetitive because there's really not a whole lot of content it is. It's pretty recycled it's pretty repetitive when everyone's uploading roughly about the same stuff so if you guys would like to see another video let me know if not no worries i can just go back to modern warfare videos i am however working on a little beta sniping montage so keep an eye out for that it's coming out very very soon i've been hitting a lot of stuff with this in the Pelican, so i hope you guys enjoy hit marker <laughs> It's all good. I'll catch you later, homie. Later, chat. Peace out, Drake. Thanks for the resub again, homie. Have a safe day. Holy what? You still at sub? Yeah, yeah, of course. How does Kitty get a. Yeah, I'm about to, but he's not really getting worse now. I'm fucking playing that song now. Ooh! Damn! Yeah, it's not Hey, famous with a tier one for eight months. Wilson been down. Dude. Road frag. Hostile spy plane established overhead. Delta spy plane fuel reserves at fifty percent. Delta spy plane exiting AOR. No one kill that kid. No one kill that fucking kid. You are oh going punch. Yeah. Watch your right. They're all going to be to your right, bro. Spy Enemy spike plane inbound. Eyes on. Hold up. I hit marker net. Damn, man, that is unlucky. Marker. Jump. Oh my god. <laughs> So bad, bro. 10 22 again, bro. This kitty kid. That'd be good. That'd be good. Oh, that's a game 
Wow, he can't even be behind. What are you talking about? Yeah.